Hey guys, welcome back to another haul video. Um, today's haul is kind of all over the place. Um, some jewelry, some Walmart, some things I've gotten in the mail, just different things. So, uh, first up, I will do some jewelry. I found this necklace um, for $5 at Walmart. This one at Walmart, $5. It's kind of just on a black cord, but I like that fringe detail. Um, some Kato bracelets. See that? Just little, little cute bracelets. Um, this was from Torrid. Necklace from Torrid. I love that bar there. It's pretty cool. Sorry, that's a very loud vehicle out my window. Um, hold on a second. I'm a little tangled. Okay. This was on sale at Clearance for $2.99. That was awesome, I thought. Um, and it's a great little tassel, um, just a brown wooden necklace. I love that. Um, this was even lower. This was marked down to $1.99. So, super excited with that. Um, it's just a really long silver necklace. So, you know how you check out and they have the, you know, the clearance stuff right beside the checkout line? They do that on purpose, you know. Um, but it was cool. So, I got some uh, Vivid Hot Lacquer Maybelline um, something. I don't know. Anyway, lipstick, liquid lipstick maybe. Um, some shadow shields. Um, I want to do some eye looks on here for you guys. And so I got these that makes the wing eyeliner better or, you know, when I'm over here doing whatever on the side, it doesn't like go over and it's not hard to clean up. So this help, the little sticky strips will help that hopefully. We'll see. Um, I can't remember if I've shown those. Those are earrings from Kato as well. I just love that color. I'm a sucker for that color. Um, I got some e.l.f. brushes. I really like the quality of the e.l.f. brushes personally. Like, I don't know. I I have some MAC brushes and things, but for the price, I mean, I love them, but for the price, I these are these are fine. I mean, they blend just fine for me. So, um, I'm tired of all the chip nails. If you can see all my chip nails, and I just don't want to paint fingernails for a while. So, I bought some uh, fake fingernails in this color, in this color, and some of the French manicure looking stuff. Um, uh, some relaxing um, lavender aromatherapy room and body mist. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. I went and had a massage. It was the best thing ever. There's this cool spa. And um, this is what that reminds me of. Um, so, and it was just like on TV. Oh, I've never had a full body massage before. I've had like mani pedis facials stuff like that and i had a manicure and pedicure that day as well but um and oh my god it was a hot mess because i i picked something like kind of pink to match my hair and um just got that all wrapped up um and it was like pink sparkly nail polish subtle like me um but uh it was i think she painted it on too thick like it was super goopy and thick and I don't know, maybe it's just getting old, or I'm not sure. But anyway, my toes still look great, and they did dry, but my nails, um, I must have left too early, and they did not dry, so, and I bumped them and things, and they just looked awful. And honestly, still, I tried to still paint over it. I, like, I took it off as much as I could, but God, that glitter's not coming off. I have lots of glitter nail polish, okay? I'm a glittery kind of girl, but there's no glitter that is, I've ever seen that is stronger than this stuff. And so I was even filing it off. I mean, it was just crazy glitter. And it still is. So I just gave up one night. It was like 3 o'clock in the morning. I'll forget this. I'm going to bed. Cannot, cannot do this anymore. So there's still a little glitter on there. I'm going to have to file off later. It'll be okay. But back to the spa. Um, tell me if you guys have had massages before and what type. And I want to do that hot stone massage next time. She did put this like big hot towel thing or maybe it's like a wrap or something over me. So that was pretty cool. Um, but I love the, the dark room and the ambiance and the, you know, just the soft music and the, the smells and the oils. And it was fabulous. And the big fluffy robes. I really didn't really want to take off my robe. I just want that robe to go home. Um, but uh, they were brown and gorgeous and oh, 
so awesome. The, now the flicker things, the little shoes, I wasn't crazy about those because, yeah. but um, but the rope, it was it was awesome. Um, so we did our massage and um, it, I think it lasted about an hour, and um, I was just like, ha oh, ha, oh, so so relaxed. I see totally see why people. Uh, it's addictive. I'm just saying it's addictive. Um, but I really, really enjoyed it. So I definitely want to do that again. And I told my boyfriend we should totally get like a couple's massage or something like that and do that for some special occasion in the future. Um, and guys, I don't want to mislead you. In one of the other videos, um, a tour at Hall, I was talking about that we were going to look for rings. Um, we're not actually engaged yet. It's not official. We were just going to look that day. And of course, I ruined it because my tour thing took two hours. But, um, but I don't want to mislead anybody, so we're just discussing it, and we want to do it, and that kind of thing. But So we were just going for a try-on and that kind of stuff, so we are going back. But, you know, I appreciate all the congratulations, though, but it's just a little premature, so it's okay. Um, but I will definitely tell you guys as soon as we are, so um, no worries there. All right, so next up, I have some other cool stuff. Um... My cousin sent me The Life-Changing Magic of Tidying Up by Marie Kondo. Love this book. She actually didn't know I already had that, but um, that's okay. And that's actually been inspiring me to clean out a lot. So um, I will, I don't know. This is a hard cover, though, so I do like that better than the soft cover. So, all right. She also sent me um, Return to Appalachian Magic, Straight Talk, Mystery of Magic in the Hills by Janet Rice, a memoir. And um, I love that because, as you guys know, I live in the Appalachian Mountains, and I'm very interested in things like this, and um, especially near Halloween and, you know, things like that, just researching our past and our culture and that kind of thing. Um, this is a portable coloring. It's portable coloring for creative adults, and it's uh, Natural Wonders, so it's very pretty. And um, it's like just basically an adult coloring book. Um, you can't see that very good but um i don't know i've never really tried this i know it's a big trend um i may give it a try and see what i think so uh she also sent me this awesome um print at a festival that she went to it's called sea maiden and it has her and the mermaid and the little cat and it has this really long thing on the back and it's awesome so I'll uh, have to get frames for those soon. I think I want to put this one up. Um, this is Sea Maiden and Sea Master. So that's really cool there. I love that. And I love mermaids. I'm sure it was a mermaid in another life. Okay, next. I got happy mail. This um, is from, I've been meaning to do this for several days, so let me just empty this out here. Um, this is from a girl here on YouTube, and I won her giveaway, um, or her, like, you know, thing, um, comp not competition. I guess it's a giveaway, like, you know, you leave a comment and you get something. Okay, so anyway, her name is Mina O'Keefe, and um, she has a channel here. She's check her out. She's awesome. She does plus size clothing. Um, the other day, her husband was doing her makeup. That was super cute, and her kid did her makeup. So adorable, and, um... So, she's really fun. But anyway, so this is what I got in my prize. I think, actually, I think this was what I was winning. I don't know. But she put some extra stuff in there with me. So, I'm excited. Um, it was this. And I'm sorry, this one got cracked on the way. But that's okay. I can still use it. I don't mind. But this is gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, Cover Girl True Naked Jewels. And those are all colors that I will definitely use. Maybe I can do a look with this palette on here sometime. I don't know why. I'm sorry. I keep looking over here and I should look here over here um this is the um l'oreal infallible paints liquid eyeliner i love this girl i cannot wait to try this i did i was wanting to try it actually this morning but i didn't want to open it until i could show it on here and say thank, thank you thank you thank you um this is in electric blue which i love 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 and this is probably my favorite thing so this is awesome um all Day Intense Gloss by CoverGirl Outlast All Day. You know this is my color. Let's just test it out. Let's see. It says this is step one. I don't know if you'll... Yeah, it livens mine, right? I don't know if you'll be able to see it over top, but you will. 
<laughs> awesome. And then this is the gloss end. Totally love that. It's very pretty. And it feels really good on too. Anyway, okay. So thank you, thank you, Nina. That's not all. It's a great package. Um, this is the Vivid Matte Liquid Lip um, by, it's called Smoky Rose, number 38. Uh, oh, Maybelline, there it is. I did already try this out, and I really love this color. So this is the perfect package for me. Um, this is the L'Oreal Paris uh, Infallible Eyeshadows in the color Amber Rush. I love that color. Love it, love it, love it. Let's see if I can carefully open it. Don't know. Maybe you can get a little bit better view there. I love shiny. Oh. So I'm going to try that out tomorrow. It's going to match my outfit perfectly. And also um, the same thing in Endless Pearl. That looks like an awesome color too. Perfect together actually. And girl, I've been wanting to try these. I totally I did not get them at Ulta and I, oh, I was kicking myself the whole way home. So I'm so glad you sent me this. I really, it's the Infallible Paints uh, Metallics and this one is Rose Chrome. And this was the color I wanted. Thank you, thank you. So um, now I'll know if I like these and that's awesome. But um, so I'm super excited about this. But thank you, girl. I appreciate it. And you guys should check out her videos. All right. So I have one more thing. Um, these are a couple little things from Walmart. I got another shirt with that kind of well, braided kind of neckline. If you can see that. Um, just a black tank sleeveless. Um, also got this one there. Kind of a dark purple. Um, I got this one. And guys, oh my God looks good with this hair what am I gonna do when I go back to work except this color like this color in black that is going to be my whole wardrobe well, what am I gonna do when I run out of this color there's only so many shirts they make in that color so I don't know anyway um this is a gray one and and these are these are 11.77 and then these are 6.97. I think that's just a, a great, you could put something over that, or I just wear them by themselves, but um, uh, 6.97 is a great price, I think, so. All right, guys, hope you're having a great night, and I will chat with you later. Bye.